Anyways, just uh, had a radio, uh, a friend of mine wants me to do a review on the radio and, uh, that he just purchased, and uh, he wanted me to do a little review on it. And uh, it's actually a very cool little little radio, i got to say. Uh, apparently you can buy it online for like 158 bucks. It's a HF QRB, QRP SDR transceiver. It's very, very neat. i got to say, very neat. Um... It's cool. <laughs> that's, that's, that's all I gotta say. It's that's a cool radio. All right. Let's uh let's have a little look and see what it has. Um, I gotta get me one of these. This 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 all I gotta say about it. I got to get me one of these. Okay, guys. This is the radio. It's a HFQRP SDR transceiver. Um, very very neat. Uh, the side panels here. Both yep, charge with a built in battery. There's a fair bit of weight to this radio. That's the power input. Uh, power switch. I'm thinking it's power switch. Uh, inner jack for DC 13.8 volts, 3 amps. On the front, we got a PTT switch right here. On the side. We've got a key jack, PA mic, UART, and a speaker jack. This side nothing, that side nothing. Very, very cool. The It has a nice menu. There's a nice few uh, options in the menu here. I'll just go right through them right quick just so you can see what they all are. Very cool. You can change your tune rate to whatever you prefer. And so you got a frequency display here, your mode, uh, S meter. You can set this up to, uh, I think it's four different ways you can set your S meter. Uh, let's see, where is it? S meter. S meter, here we go. Oh, that's WR. S meter, here we go. So right now she's on S, so you can change that between S meter, S bar, uh, WEM, I guess that's word per minute, I would think, and the DBM, you know, or to off. So, yeah. Very cool. You can change your mode. Right from the freight from this button. So she does upper lower side band and CW. One thing that does have that I'm sure a lot of people are going to love with this thing. Um, it has, let me see, filter. Bandwidth filter. Very cool. Especially when you want to use CW and whatnot. Comes in handy. <laughs> nice little radio. Um, over the next couple days, I'm gonna be doing a doing a couple little videos on this thing. Uh, my buddy wants me to test it out, run down the air if I can. He's got the, there's a microphone that comes with this thing, and he also has an auto tuner. Cool auto tuner for this thing as well. What a cool little radio! I gotta get me one of these. I really do. This is neat. Let's bring the volume up some. It's menu driven. I mean, you know, it's only a few little menu items. 
Let me get a bent head of sheep over. Very cool. I guess one thing you're inter you might be interested in is know how she uh, how she performs to uh, FT8. So I got my computer handy, or phone, I should say. Um, let's see how the phone reacts to this. Very cool radio. Change bands on it. So it was ten meters, twelve, fifteen, seventeen, twenty, thirty, forty, sixty, eighty. So there's all the uh, all the amateur bands.
Nuclear Radio. HF QRP SD air transceiver. Nice. Hey anyway, folks, I'll have uh, we'll up a couple of videos over the next in the wall, for the next few days. And we'll uh, try out there and see if we make contact or whatever and see how she sounds on there. Anyways. Very cool. The patrol here is a bit jumpy. Go slow, would it? <laughs> Very cool. Hey, folks. All the best, 7 3. And we'll see you in the next video. We'll uh, hook up the auto tuner and we'll try this thing on there. See you later. 7 3, folks. All the best.